Hi everyone, in this video I am going to introduce 74LS138 which is a 3 to 8 decoder, very 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 important 74LS138 which can be used for the construction of higher order decoders, ok. So 74LS138 which is a 3 to 8 decoder as the name clearly tells that it is, see if you want to remember you can remember in this way also, 38 is there at the end, so 3 to 8 decoder. Previous videos we have seen 74139 that is that is 224 decoder that is a two, dual 224 decoder ok. So the integrated circuit consists of 3 enable pins consists of 3 enable pins first I will give you the specifications and then we go for the IC it is a 3 to 8 decoder it is not a dual 3 to 8 decoder, it is a single 3 to 8 decoder. That IC consists of only one 3 to 8 decoder. It has, it has 3 enable pins. 3 enable pins, very, very, very important. This particular IC consists of 3 enable pins, whereas the previous any IC consists of a single enable pin, which is used, which is just used to enable or disable the Pin. But this particular can't the, uh, the ma main reason behind this 4138 enable pins is for cascading uh, used for used for cascading cascading for higher order for higher order sizes that means. Uh, 3 to 8 decoder means he, next we will be having 4 to 16 decoders, 5 to 32 decoders and 6 to 64 decoders like that we will be having any number but when you are constructing 3 to 8 when you are constructing such higher order decoders using 3 to 8 decoders there we will use these enable pins in cascading pins ok. So this point is very 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 important enable pins and those enable pins are those are what are the pins we are having g1 g2a underscore l g2b underscore l g1 is an active high pin g2a g2b are active low enable pins active low enable pins it has along with these enable pins three inputs and four three inputs and four outputs sorry three inputs and eight outputs three inputs are active high and eight outputs are active low eight outputs are active low don't forget this concept Okay, and here also one enable pin is active low, active high, and two enable pins are active low. Now coming to the IC diagram. IC diagram. So the first one is G1 and G2A, G2B, these two are active low pins. G2A, sorry, G2B, active low pins. So these three are enable pins, enable pins and we have inputs A, B, C, act to high pins A, B, C, A naught, A 1, A 2 for our convenience we can name it like this and the outputs are all act to low so 4. 5, 6, 7, 8. Okay. So, it is y <coughs> not underscore l, y1 underscore l, y2, y3, y4, y5, y6, y7. It is 7, 4, 1, 3, 8. 7, 4, 1, 3, 8 decoder. Okay. By seeing the name in examinations, you, are, you will be asked like 
draw the IC diagram of 74138 and explain its operation with truth table. Simply, they may ask like that. And you are also been asked like, uh, draw, uh, write the VHDL code for 74X138. 74138. <coughs> then, you must understand that 74LS138 uh, specifies it is a 3TI decoder. Without knowing its operation, you cannot write the code or any operation. Okay, so first of all, you should understand what is 74 ls138 by seeing the name you are, and understand that it is a 328 decoder okay now coming to the truth table see for the activation of this chip what is the set of enable uh, enable pins for enabling this ic what is the combination of enable pins g1 should be 1 g1 should be 1 g2a should be 0 g2b should be 0 then it will be activated okay other than this combination Whatever the combination you give, the chip is in deactivated state. Hope you understand the meaning of enable pin. Okay. So, that's why in the truth table, in the truth table, it is clearly mentioned that enable pins G1, G2A underscore L, G2B underscore L and N A. A is nothing but A2, A1. You will better write from the corner see g1 g2a underscore l g2b underscore l a2 a1 a naught and similarly y7 underscore l y6 underscore l y5 underscore l y4 y3 y2 y1 y0 okay same 3 day decoder same truth table but additionally we are having three enable pins so enable pin if enable pin is any case other than this 1 0 0 0 See, other than this 100, 0, 0, if any other enable pins are given, whatever may be the input, the output simply act to once. Once means there is no output. Now, enabled, chip is enabled because G1 is equal to 1 and G2A, G2B are 0. So, so depends on the input combination. Depends on the input combination. Output is corresponding output is activated. Okay, I hope you know the truth table. So, this is 100, 100. So, input combinations 001, 010, 011. 100, 101, 110 and 111. So, depends on the corresponding decimal number, the particular pin is activated and remaining all are deactivated. Five, so fifth line is activated. Sixth line is activated, and the last one is seven. So seventh line is activated. Okay, so this is this is the truth table of three to a decoder. Now coming to the VHDL code. VHDL code for this 3 to a decoder 74138 in data flow. Okay, in data flow, we will write so library IEEE use IEEE dot std underscore logic underscore 1164 dot all. Okay, we know these two statements specifies library and package and coming to entity entity decoder. Uh, sorry, IC, you better write IC, 
because you are writing uh, for IC. IC seven four one three eight is IC seven four one three eight is port. So what are the input pins we have? G one G two A underscore L G two B underscore L. Give the same pins in STD logic. STD logic single bits so single there is no vector and input pins are there a in std logic vector of size 2 down to 0 and y output y underscore l out std logic vector of 7 down to 0. This is what the entity part and IC74138. Now coming to architecture data flow data flow of IC74138 IC underscore IC underscore 74138 is is begin mm, take a signal signal some y std underscore logic underscore vector of 7 down to 0 begin begin conditional statement with input is a select so y is first assigned with y is equal to y is equal to so how what is the size of the y 8 bit so 8 bit which is at to low so that's why it is 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 last one is 0 when a becomes triple 0 comma similarly 1 1 1 1 and 0 1 4 4 okay when 0 0 1 and you write statement similar statements like this until 1 0 1 1 1 1 1 1 when it is sixth pin so 1 1 0 what about 7th one? 7th one you should write others. So, 0, 1, 1, 1, 1, 1, 1, 1, when others, when others. Okay. So, with others we can say that it uh, conditional statements are completed. And now, now when this y should be assigned with y underscore l, when the enable pin set is 1, 0, 0. Okay. So, that means y underscore l is equal to y when when g1 and g2a underscore l sorry not not because those two are at to low pins so not g2a underscore l and not g2b underscore l okay hmm. else else what is the output all are ones semicolon and data flow Okay, this is the this is the VHDL code for TTI decoder seven four one three eight. Okay, thank you.